sometimes we want grand ideas grand you know 100,000 people it sounds great but I think sometimes we lose the value of the importance of your local community so I would say as a company before you have this grand idea think about how you're impacting your environment around you especially now with climate change you want to be reducing your carbon anyway footprint so thinking about your local um, communities and how you're empowering them with the information they need and then I think with that you can kind of get feedback to say okay maybe we want to develop a course that anyone can do um, because we've been able to kind of focus on our immediate surrounding first and we've been able to learn from them how we can improve our course now let's do another global scale or mass scale so I think starting small is very important and by starting small it's such a great time because you get so much um, I think even for me as a business owner with Sadia the early days of us having that community meet up was so important because I was able to understand things that I didn't even think about when it came to what women might be interested in so like using having now we're in a hybrid um, position but the importance of online events, recording our events, so those who can't make it. So things like that. And I think as an organization, if you're thinking about improving digital literacy, is getting that feedback with your immediate audience and connecting with a community hall, community groups, um, looking at organizations around your um, physical company, and then how can you connect with those organizations and how can you share your skills as a cor corporate social responsibility. So I think that's kind of a small way you can start mm -hmm. and then you can start building on that and then it could become something great. Yeah.